at 5.30, a high school student raped in her school parking lot while class was in session. Investigators say the victim knew her attacker. I'm Leah Martin. And I'm Paula Eben. Tonight, students tell us the news of this assault makes them feel unsafe. Bill Shields has the story from Brockton. He's a 44-year-old father of five, but police say Andy Tao raped a 19-year-old girl after luring her out of class at Brockton High. When reading the text messages, it became clear that the defendant was trying to coerce the victim. Police say last week, Tao drove his minivan to the high school parking lot, then texted the girl to come out that he had brought her lunch. When she met him, police say she was raped. In court, through a translator, Tao says he met the girl two years ago at a family party and that they were simply friends. But the victim says the text messages became explicit. The conversation then switches to the defendant asking if they can make love the next time he comes to visit. But Tao's defense attorney says there was never a rape. He states that he has text messages from the alleged victim will prove his innocence. The students at Brockton High were notified about the incident and many were stunned. Oh, well, you can't really trust people nowadays, so she has to be careful who she trusts. It's pretty bad. Yeah. It feels unsafe now. Police have now confiscated the suspect's cell phone because they claim that after the assault, he texted his victim asking her, are you okay? In Brockton, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.